Hey guys, welcome back. So today in this video, I will show you all tools you need to downgrade your iPhone 3G back to the original version of iPhone OS or iOS or however you want to call it 2.0 and yes you've heard right to the real version of iOS 2.0 because as you know I've made a video for the downgrade of the iPhone 3G back to iPhone or iOS or however you want to call it 2.0 so but if you have seen this video you may know that it's only a custom version if I jump quickly to my iPhone 3G right here well, I have 16 gigabyte if I quickly jump to it you may see that there is no studio as you can see there's no page right here um, reduce the brightness a little bit this may be a bit easier for you guys to see and on my focus so right now as you can see there is no studio installer whatsoever and you can see there on the top is SMS text app it's the old style dock there on the bottom but that's no proof because it could be also iOS 3 there fetch new data it's on push the settings page is really small and if I go into general about you can see that I am running iOS or iPhone OS 2.0 on my 16 gigabyte iPhone 3G and white so you may gonna ask how is this possible so I've made a video on this and uh, I want to upload it about one month ago but I had some problems with my Wi-Fi so it's over 8 gigabytes of data so it's just like impossible to upload in my low speed Wi-Fi so what I've done is I've decided to cut the video in several parts so the audio should be better right now um, so I have decided to cut the video in several parts and the first part I'm gonna show you as I mentioned before is the tools I used for the downgrade so I'm gonna show you the tools I have installed so as you can see I got a bunch of tools right on my desktop so I have Retino, iRab you need Wondershare Dr. Phone for iOS I'm gonna explain what this is you need iTunes and of course you need all these IPSW versions so I'm gonna show you the links what to download how to download and I'm gonna set this in the first video and then in the second video I'm gonna show you how to actually do this whole process i'm gonna put of course the links in the description and so let's just get started i have already prepared the links so it makes easier for us to search for it so i've prepared um red snow irab wondershare doctor phone for ios ipsw.me and um, for itunes I think you all know how to get it, but if not, I'm gonna put the link down in the description. So first begin with the downgrade custom IPSW version of iOS 2.0. So it was released by a guy called Soupsnow. I'm gonna link his Twitter down below in the description. Um, basically, when you download it, your computer, if you are on Windows, gonna detect it as a virus but don't worry guys I've installed it twice I'm gonna re-put the link in the description for my downgrade video of the custom version and the original maker of the video is called the Apple buyer I'm gonna put his uh, video in the description down below as well so the next tool is called you need it's called red snow so for iOS 4.2.1, you 
you're gonna need very old version so I recommend you guys don't get too old with Red Snow 3.0 um, try to get 9.6 beta 4 if you're on Mac you click on Mac if you're on Windows you click on Windows I don't want to click on it because I already have installed it so next is called I hate snow not calm and uh, if you can see he got a couple of programs down here forecast for Mac Windows eye detector is basically a tool that shows if you have an iPhone 3GS with the old or the new boot room then I faith is I don't know what it is I've never tried it as far as I know it's a jailbreak but really I'm not sure so I clicked on it so accidentally so what you need is irab r7 if you are on windows and irab for mac os x if you are on mac so you're gonna click on one of these links if you need it so i don't click on it as well because i've already downloaded it so next is dr phone want to share dr phone for ios so it's compatible with windows mac so if you are on Mac or Windows, you're gonna click on one of these icons there. You can try it for free. It's a very good program. You don't need to buy it. If you want, you can buy it, but I recommend you to try it for free. And lastly, we need the original IPSWs for the downgrade. So click on iPhone, scroll all the way down to iPhone 3G. And as you can see from iOS 4.2.1 there, or generally from the iPhone 3G, only three IPSWs are unsigned. So that's iOS 4.0, 4.0.2, 4.0.1, and 4.0.2. So what you need to download is first, of course, the iPhone, the iOS, sorry, 4.2.1 IPSW and the iPhone OS or iOS 2.0 version and as you can see it's not a custom version it's just a real deal and you're gonna need this so that's it for my videos for the tools I'm gonna explain the tools and how to use it on my downgrade video um, these tools are useful for probably every downgrade video and stuff I'm gonna do maybe also for jailbreak and i hope you've liked the video hope you're gonna invest a time the about 30 minutes for the downgrade i know it's very long time but it's absolutely worth it if we jump quick to it as you can see ios 2.0 it's such a beauty try to grab another one and make comparison between ios two other ones and try to make comparison to iOS 2.0, 3.0, and 4.0. or 4.1 because 4.0 isn't signed anymore. Um, will be an awesome video. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Stay tuned if you want to see the real method for the downgrade. Subscribe if you don't have subscribed already. Leave a like and a comment. And peace out.